also I got a new way of advertising guys I'm putting my YouTube business cards I'm trying to get rid of these because I'm gonna make some new ones uh, but I'm putting them in envelopes and uh, basically addressing them to Albertsons I'm gonna do like a different store every day that I do this uh, but right now it's Albertsons it's a grocery store and what I do is I'll put like uh, I got like five cards here five of them and then I put that one on the top it says Wouldn't that be funny if Angel just like went ape shit on her, like I, like has. a cat fight? She has it. It doesn't. It does not make her stop. Are you serious? Yeah. Like ape shit. Ape shit. Like. Are you serious? She's blinking everything. <laughs> She's blinking everything. Shoot. Come here, for it. You're gonna get in the middle of that. You better so not goofy. gang up on her. Forty, move. Just because that puppy's fucking with her, don't mean you are. Get her. Get her, Angel. I mean, this is a video all in itself. Get her, Angel. This is hilarious. She ain't scared of nothing. Get her, Angel. Angel's like, I'm going to get the oh, fuck out of here. What are you guys doing? I let Keiko out with the with the neighbor dogs. Yeah. Kind of dark out here. <laughs> so I uh, Saturday I'm chilling, just waking up. Yesterday was uh, insane. My body's sore, but you know I'm I'm all good. I'm chilling today. It's Saturday, so all is good. I was just over. I, fi I finished paying my landlord the rest of her rent and stuff, and put the laundry over there. And uh, I noticed they had an Xbox 360, and I was like, all right, well shoot, I got like at least a controller. And Tony's got some 360 games, maybe I can give them. And she's like, well, make sure they're not in violent ones. I'm, right, I, I'm like, oh, all right, we'll see if we can find any non-violent games. And then look at Tony's stack of games. This is hilarious. Watch, guys. We got Battlefield 4. Hmm, pretty violent. We got Call of Duty Ghost. Yeah, also pretty violent. We got Sniper Elite 3. Hmm, say that's pretty violent. We got Ace Comet, Comet Assault Horizon. That looks pretty violent too. And we got Battle of the Damned. It looks like a movie, but also it looks pretty violent. Uh, Sniper Elite, violent. Call of Duty Black Ops 1 and 2. Classics, but also violent. Uh, Black Ops 3, very violent. Love that game. Love violence. Uh, Black Ops 1. <laughs> <laughs> Call of Duty Advanced Warfare that is also violent. Or a Phantom, Phantom something. What is that? Phantom Metal Gear Phantom. The Phantom. The Phantom. Okay, looks violent. I mean, I was just starting to think about it. Like it's probably violent. <laughs> yeah, that looks violent. Okay. Oh shit, we found one. Forza Motor Motorsport Three. All right. So we give them one game. Out of all those, damn. You no, know, I personally, if I was a kid, I want all the violent ones, but you know, she doesn't want her kids messing around with all that. So, Forza it is. What do you got going here? <laughs> what is that, huh? That's a ball that's the size of you. It's the size of you. That's crazy. Can I get it? Can I get it? Okay, here it goes. Oh, okay, here it goes. There it goes. <laughs> <laughs> <Here's the dog. laughs> so crazy yeah there she goes <sighs> so I got some gaming to do we're definitely doing a live stream I got a ton of video editing I got two vlogs in the bank and I'm vlogging now so we're working on vlog three I had a lot of editing to do and then um, that company got back to me and sent me some clips uh, so I'm going to edit a vlog, or not a vlog, but a video for them, at least one. 
Um, I said tomorrow, I'll probably shoot for tomorrow on that. Yeah, lots of editing to do. So I got a new way of advertising, guys. I'm putting my YouTube business cards, I'm trying to get rid of these because I'm going to make some new ones. Uh, but I'm putting them in envelopes and uh, basically addressing them to Albertsons. I'm going to do like a different store every day that I do this. Uh, but right now it's Albertsons. It's a grocery store. And what I do is I'll put like, uh, i got like five cards here. Five of them. And then I put that one on the top. It says, hello, please do me a favor and put these cards on your bulleted board. Thank you so much. Have an awesome day. So yeah, so I'm set, I'm sending this to all these Albertson stores. So I got Seattle, we got Auburn, we got two from Port Orchard, um, we got Gig Harbor, and Olympia. I'm not sure how effective this is gonna be, but I figure like the manager is gonna open this up at the very least, and they're either gonna throw it in the trash, or they're gonna hang it up, or they're gonna give it to an employee to go hang it up. So then that's already exposed to two people. And they're like, probably going to be thinking, who's this Commander Vlogs guy? And probably go check me out. And uh, best case scenario, they'll put it on the bulletin board. And we will get some, uh, some publicity from these bulletin boards. I'm going to be sending these off to a bunch of different stores like Safeways, Walmarts, Targets. Uh, if you guys have any suggestions on where I should mail these to next, let me know. I'm kind of thinking like Chevrons and small gas stations, like convenience stores maybe, might be another idea. I don't know. Anywhere that has a bulletin board, let me know if you have any ideas. Go for a quick walk, yeah. We're going to take her, we're going to go for a quick walk to the mailbox and turn these in. Kind of looks like it might be raining soon. <laughs> it's nice out here. Nice day for a little walk. Just gonna mill these though, that's it. What's funny is I reused these envelopes. Um, they were like some old mailers that I made up for my old landscaping business. Had all the flyers in them already. And uh, it was all, the envelopes were all sealed. So I actually had to cut like an incision at the end of the envelope. Took the old flyers out and put these cards in and then taped it back up. Pretty crazy, huh? <laughs> it's like, hey man, I need some envelopes. So I had to do it. Oh, somebody's coming. Somebody's coming. Are you pooping? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> he was all freaking out because there's a carload of dogs. <laughs> and they're all making noise. Now he's all freaking out. Oh, that, huh? What was that? You heard a bunch of doggies? Doggies making noise? Yeah. <laughs> so we mailed off to Albertsons. Next will be Safeway. Um, and like Walmart, Target, Winco. I don't know. Every store that you can think of, I'm gonna hit everyone in Washington. And then once I do, we're gonna start with, with Oregon. And we'll do California. Yep. We get every, every store. In every state in the United States, I'll just keep on buying stamps and envelopes. <laughs> I know that's going to get a lot of exposure. I know this. Somebody's going to open them envelopes, you know, and that's just, that's one person right there. Even if they don't hang them up on the bulletin board like I ask. But you never know. They might. And I'll really appreciate it if they do. What's up guys what's going on so um, I'm gonna go ahead and stream on mixer right now um, hopefully you guys will go there and give me a follow that'd be really awesome I'd love to see you there uh, I'm gonna be streaming Fortnite uh, this is my mixer here I'll show you it's like the new setup here streaming exclusively on mixer guys and it's a uh, MBRS commander all one word guys search me up on mixer Say MBRS Commander. All right, I'm gonna stream some Fortnite and get some wins tonight. That is the plan. What's up, guys? What's going on? It's Monday. I'm back to work. 
Uh, today I got a simple job. We got to pick up some ABS hose up in uh, Seattle. Uh, it's just like the whole driving to Seattle and back part is like the hardest part of it, really. Because <laughs> I just literally got to pick it up, throw it in the truck, and come back to the to the yard. So not too bad so far. I'm a little tired, you know. It's all right. I'll wake up. Um, Yesterday we uh, tried the new open beta of uh, Modern Warfare. They call it Modern Warfare. It's kind of funny because there was a Modern Warfare already a long time ago. So I don't know why they like come up with a different name. It's kind of funny. But uh, it's actually pretty smooth. I like it. It, it plays smooth and uh, now it's doing pretty good. There was a couple games there where I got over 2KD. So, eh, yeah, it's not bad. It's a pretty ambitious weekend, guys. I put up two vlogs, uh, which I edited in the same day on Saturday. And then Sunday, I edited for that company, finally. I uh, edited a video for them, and uh, they might want to add more to the video, but they really liked what I did, so that's pretty awesome. Uh, but yeah, views are down a little bit not sure why I'm not really doing much networking so maybe that's why I don't know I'm trying my best but you know juggling a lot and it is what it is <laughs> but uh, yeah if you guys uh, missed the last video it was really good it's a longer one but it's really good it's uh, this uh, video where I went to Heron Island and I caught a ferry and I got a lot of like really cool footage on the ferry and stuff and then we did like this big digging job and I installed risers and stuff but yeah check it out it's the last video I appreciate that give it some watch time if you would well guys we're leaving Seattle we got the ADS hose on board as you can see it in the back there whole shit ton of it uh, it's about the maximum I can hold in this truck and uh, someone just called on the radio and asked if I wanted to add any more to the load and I was like oh no I can't pick up any more I gotta drop this off first <laughs> so yeah man I hate Seattle I hate driving in Seattle. I don't really hate Seattle I just hate driving in Seattle and now we're leaving so I'm chill there's a Boeing field on the ride So I went to the GC coffee uh, stand and uh, I told her the other day I had a free one. Like literally, I don't know how many I had to buy to earn that free one. It seems like 20 coffees or something like that. I don't know, but I had a free one. And they said like when I get my free one, I get any size, even a 32 ounce. So I was really stoked about it, but then I lost my stupid card. It's like kind of like a card that they scan. It's not a punch card. It's like a, uh, almost like a credit card or something. Anyway, I lost it. So basically, I lost my free one. So I went up to the window and I told her about it. And she's like, oh, I'll just give you a free one. So, so, so nice, so sweet. So I uh, I said, all right, I'll take you up on it. And then I gave her a $5 tip because, like, for real, that's, that's nice. And, you know, normally those coffees are, like, six, seven bucks. So I was like, you know what, I'll just throw her a five. So I got my, my 32 ounce, look at this. So it's a um, Red Bull Watermelon Italian Soda with Cream. Mmm. It is awesome. Hell yeah. But yeah, she said if I find my card I can just use it. I'm like, no, no, I wouldn't do that. Like, I'm honest, I wouldn't do that. Plane coming in for landing. <laughs> one about to take off. I told her if I find the, the free one, then I'll just throw it away because I'm I'm honest man I wouldn't do that you know um some girls work hard you know and they gotta earn their money if I'm always there cashing out free ones then <laughs> you know what I'm saying yeah this one's gonna take off there's another one about to take off there it goes. So 
So anyway, I'm on lunch break. Um, got rid of the ADS, and now uh, I got a job lined up where I'm gonna be sawing some concrete, and uh, then we're gonna break it up, most likely, and then do some digging. Yeah, another digging day. Fun, fun, fun. And then we back. What's up, guys? I'm home after a long day of jackhammering concrete, picking up and carrying concrete, and digging lots and lots of dirt. And uh, of course, the long drive to Seattle in the morning and the long drive back. So, yeah, it was a pretty long day. I met up with my girl, though. Kind of, you know, spent a little bit of time with her. Just kind of hung out in, in a parking lot. And um, we had some, uh, I'm going to put myself on blessed. <laughs> we had some uh, some haagen ice cream. Uh, just a cone with a little bit of ice cream. Only about yay big. Not that big, but, you know. Um, still, yeah, I'm putting myself on blast. I had the ice cream and I got Papa Murphy's for dinner. All right, so this is not gonna be a normal habit, but as you can see, it is 8.16. I ain't got time to cook nothing or prepare anything or even prepare lunch. <sighs> they got me scheduled tomorrow and it looks like uh, maybe even a bigger job where I'm Cutting concrete and jackhammering concrete and carrying concrete and mixing concrete and lots of digging and yeah. So my back and my neck are sore as hell right now. So kind of sucks. I don't know. I'm going to take a hot shower. Uh, try to get a good night's sleep tonight and get ready for tomorrow because got to go back at it again. But I'm already sitting at 29 hours. So, you know, hey, if I get 10 hours tomorrow, let's say 10 hours the next day. Then we'll be at overtime like 48 hours again, 49 hours or whatever, which would be really good. Anyway, um, this is what I got for lunch. Salad. Let me pull this bad boy out. It's an Italian salad. So that'd be pretty good. I'll probably pack this with like maybe one nice solid slice of pizza. That'll be my lunch tomorrow, and I'll have at least maybe two or three slices for tonight and the rest will be leftovers for tomorrow night that's probably what's gonna happen she is guys going on into the oven family size stuffed big murphy which can be found at papa murphy's take and bake love this place man it's my favorite my favorite food is pizza and this is my favorite place to get it so i highly recommend it if you guys haven't tried papa murphy's pizza um, a lot of you, like other parts of the United States, don't even have Papa Murphy's, and I feel bad for you. A lot of you over there that don't have Papa Murphy's say Papa John's is the best, but you haven't had Papa Murphy's. And plus, this is a take and bake. It's a total different thing, and you cook it yourself. It's nice and fresh out of the oven, and the ingredients and just the, the flavor of the pizza is just, it's unbeatable. Boom, look at that bad boy. Does look good, huh? Hell yeah. It's 8.55 already. Uh, I'm probably gonna be heading to bed soon, man. So I gotta get up nice and early. Keiko doggy with all his energy at nine o'clock at night. How do you have so much energy? What's with your ear? Why is your ear stuck that way, huh? What happened? Oh, there it is. You fixed it. <laughs> That's good doggy. Good doggy. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> Crazy dope. Look at my mileage, guys. One, 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 one. <laughs> kind of crazy. Uh. Anyways, I'm heading to work. I got another big concrete job. Lots of jackhammering and cutting concrete. Carrying concrete, throwing it around, and digging dirt. I'm already, I'm sore from yesterday, so it's going to be fun. <laughs> Shit. Anyways, almost to work, so I'm go take on the day. It's all good. So I just figured out the place I'm working today is a high school, 
which means prevailing wage money. That's right. Uh, whenever I work for like a state, city, or county, I think it is, um, I get prevailing wage. And in high school, that's, uh, I guess that would be state or city. I don't know. It's one of the two, and I know it's prevailing wage. So I'm very happy about that, and we're definitely getting some hours in there. Like, literally, we're going to be there for probably most of today, if not all day. So, holy crap. Bring on that money. Yeah. One thing that sucks is it's, it's raining out here, guys. But, uh, you know what? I got a raincoat. I'll put on my rain pants, even though it's, like, kind of uncomfortable, and I sweat a lot when I wear that, but it's all good. Love that. I love that on the back of uh, this van. It says the Empire doesn't care about your stick figured family. <laughs> Shit is funny as hell. <sighs> I got a. Uh, I got myself another Red Bill Italian soda with cream watermelon. Mmm. From GC Coffee. Anyway, um, it's funny. It kind of sucks, but. Uh, there was three gals working in there. I think it was at least three, actually. There might have been more. But, uh, freaking, uh, they had, like, three or four bees just swarming them, man. Like, yellow jackets. And they were just doing their job. Like, they didn't even care. It was like, what the heck? Man, I feel sorry for them, though. That they gotta fight off bees. Damn. Didn't seem to bother them, though, man. I'm, I'm a brave little gals, man. I'll, I'll be, like, fighting them bees off tail to death and I wouldn't do nothing else but fight them bees <laughs> I don't like getting stung damn it I know it only hurts a little bit but I don't know I just, I gotta kill him man I ain't gonna let him let him mess with me and I'm not gonna just let him swarm around me and just like be cool with it no way not me <laughs> it's crazy hey, there's their football field it's pretty cool it's a school on that Sitting by their main office, kind of waiting for our uh, contact here on site. I haven't been able to talk to him yet. I called him, so I don't even. So I'm standing by. They got this like alarm going off right now. I don't know what that is. It's so weird. Maybe it's a fire drill. I don't know. It's still going off. Kind of weird, huh? It's been like over five minutes. <laughs> So they're they're done with their drill. It's just a lockdown drill. <laughs> so unfortunately, the job has been called off. I volunteered to work on Saturday for this job. Hopefully, they give it to me. I don't know. We'll see. The problem is, is we didn't want to set off uh, smoke alarms and um, you know make too much noise while we're jackhammering. So there was a classroom a classroom literally like next to where we were going to be working so that's why they rescheduled it for Saturday just hoping I get it I volunteered for it you know I need the extra money so I don't know fingers crossed All right now I'm heading back to the yard so far they don't have anything for me I'm going to unload the truck everything I loaded up all these bags it's like 7 bags of concrete about 5 bags of pea crap loaded up with a jackhammer concrete saw and all this shit gotta go unload and then chances are I'll probably be taking a lunch and hopefully they'll have more work for me because yeah man it's too early to be going home I want to make my hours I mean granted I'm already at like I don't know 33 hours for the week and I got one more day on the pay period so I mean either way I'm good but I'm trying to make that money guys I'm trying to trying to stash some you know what I mean Yeah, they were gonna send me home early, but I was like, no, I got something I can do. I can clean up this concrete pad here. Clean up this mess. The big ass bobcat. Look at that. So I just shovel it into there and dump it into the dumpster over there.
little bit more here. You can see the back of the truck guys drop a little more load there. That's where all this shit came from with one of these trucks. It's gonna be nice and heavy, so they're not gonna want to put anything solid in there anymore. Anyway, the bucket was so big, so like water and liquids kept running over to the left side of the bucket. When I dumped it, it fell on the left side of the dumpster. So I just gotta use the shovel and skip it up real quick. Maybe hose this area down. There we go. All, cleaned up. All done with work. They let me go after I cleaned that pad. Um, so um, as far as that high school job I haven't heard anything yet but I hope they'll have me for Saturday because like I know like a lot about the job already and it makes sense like I can just get there before the plumber and get right to work I know where everything's at so uh, yeah hopefully they use me for that because I need the extra money and uh, yeah I'm gonna kick some ass and they'll be glad they have me on the job you know what I'm saying this is how I roll only kick ass there's no other way to do things like I came to work burned out but I fucking kicked ass you know I just like you know said fuck being tired fuck being sore I just fought through the pain and I got, got shit done and that's that's what you got to do um, now it was like a few minutes early or a few minutes early a few minutes late today at work uh, I was really sore this morning and so I set my alarm again like an extra 20 minutes later and then like thought I had enough time, but you know, I didn't. And so I ended up being like, it was like three or four minutes late, which isn't really that much, but my boss still talked to me about it. And he's like, you know, kind of warned me, you know, gotta come on time, I need you on time, you know? So <sighs> I've got to just get more organized. I don't know, I, I get my lunch ready in the evening I'm trying to get like even my breakfast ready in the evening and then I can just nuke it or something or maybe it's just a sandwich I just eat it but you know I don't know um, it's a hard one I don't know my Mega Man energy like I could get that ready like kinda like I could pour like the powder in an empty water bottle and then just add water it would be quicker right Instead of washing the thing, I don't know. You know what I'm saying? So there's a few things like I can, you know, do in the night to prepare for, you know, the morning. I'm not saying like I'm gonna already put toothpaste on my toothbrush. <laughs> That'd be fucking funny, wouldn't it? Uh, uh, shit. Anyway, I'm gonna head home. Um, calling it a day. Probably gonna edit, upload this video tonight. Since I'm going home early. So that's nice. Might get on Mixer and play Rocket League. Because I downloaded some Rocket League. Um, I played it before. And it's really fun. And I was watching I was watching Keemstar of all people play it. And it looked really fun. It was funny because he like, he like rages like hardcore at his games. And his teammates and stuff. So it was just kind of funny to watch. But yeah. It made me want to get some Rocket League. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to maybe play that tonight. If I get a chance. So. Hit me up on Mixer, guys. Uh, come visit me. MBRS Commander, all one word. Anyways, guys, smash that like. Subscribe if you haven't already. And I will see you on the next one. Uh, share on your social media if you guys would. And comment below also, please. Even if you're in the premiere, comment below. Thanks, y'all. Peace out.